Hi everyone, today I'm going to do a Bond girl look. I'm using my MAC shroom and that's just going to go all the way up like this, all over. So start with the highlight under the eye. This is kind of the right time for this sort of look. If you're going to Christmas parties and and all that good stuff. So literally I'm just going to put that all over the top bun in the corner. I'm not putting it on the lid yet. Uh, then I'm going to take my MAC shade stick in shark skin and I'm just going to run that over the top eyelid just close as you can get to the lash line. This will just help because we're going to put a few little bits of eyeshadow over the top and it's got a bit of glitteriness about it. Now if you haven't got this don't worry just use a black eyeliner um, like a coal or something. So yeah, just do a fairly thick line along the top lash, like that, and underneath. Fairly thick again, because the thing about these Bond girls is they do have very striking eye makeup from my Clinique palette and I'm literally going to pop that over the black. I'm going with the kind of Vespa look um, from Casino Royale. She just was smoulderingly smoky and it was all in the flick out. It just made her eyes look really good and smoky. Huge even. So that's all I've done. I've just given myself a little bit of a wing as well. Sort of out. Like that. The same on the other side. So that lovely smoky blue over the top and flick it out. And if you find it difficult to do the flicking bit then literally just um, use a very small brush or make the shape that you want and clean it up with a little bit of um, a cotton wool bud or a q-tip or something and that will just keep it nice and neat or use an eyeliner brush that's also quite good so literally just layering that beginning to sort of build up the colour a bit and that's a good time to switch to an eyeliner brush just to really firm up. So of course there is no um, shark skin at that end. There we go. And then go underneath with your blue. As I said, the shark skin is not actually that important. A good eyeliner will do and go all the way in. I know I normally just say two thirds, but for this look, all the way in. There we go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> just thicken it up, like so going to smoke it out a touch so just give it a nice blend so just only in one direction and that's back in to the crease I mean the winged out bit looked a bit weird but now that you're going to smoke it back in it's going to look fine and it's going to take on the right shape and up and that way you're giving your yourself that really nice shape. Like that. Subtly smoky. Get the same on the other side. Just literally bring it back in and into the crease. 
super sexy and super easy. There we go. I'm loving this look. I wish I was going to a Bond party now. <laughs> Let's just bring it up. And all I did with going out was to give you that sort of shape that you, the dramatic shape that you need. Um, I wasn't going to leave it winged out like that. There we go. See that from the side. Now you can make it as light or as dark as you like. On the rest of the eyelid, I'm going to use this is my Elf little palette. I'll bring it up close. Um, and this one is the purpley purple palette. I think it's called Silver Lining. Just take this sort of mothy sort of colour, the lightest colour in the palette, and pop it on the inner corner. Literally just a dab. You don't need very much at all and just cover any bits of skin that you can see and then in the very middle of the eye take the grey in this palette and pop that in the middle just to bring all that smokiness together like this and just sort of Super smoke that out, but leave a little bit on the inside that's nice and light. Just helps open the eye a little. Or black cold pencil and run it along the inside. Now I normally say if you have dark, uh, sorry small eyes don't do this, but this look really demands the full smoky just go for it. You see it looks it looks very different. You just want it to be really full on like that and go into that corner and just wing it out a tiny bit. It just gives your eye a bit of length. Okay, so I've just put some false lashes on. I'm going to heavily line over the top just to cover up the sort of glue strips. There we go. Oops. There we go. And just go in about there. But you can't really tell where they join. It all looks black. That's much better. Um, and it's called Red Drama with a good lip pen, a lip brush. There we go, just paint it on. This one's great because it has a nice long handle. And take your time. And I'm just going to fill it in. Uh, give yourself several coats and blot in between so that it stays fast not going anywhere. And there we have it. I'll come in a little. My Vespa inspired look.